Good afternoon everyone and welcome to a brand new video. So we finally had a moment to sit down and enjoy a bite to eat after rushing from gate to gate, barely making every single connection along the way. Back at Suvannabum Airport. Going home. We just got through security. I'm getting pretty sad. We're leaving Thailand now. Officially stamped out of Thailand. So no, sad. I'm sad. Oh. We have to come back soon. We have to come back soon. So the taxi ride to the airport took about half an hour and then we waited for quite a long time in the check-in lines for the airline. The line was actually a lot longer than I thought and I was slightly nervous. But as soon as we got checked in and our baggage was checked to our final destination, we got in the security line and that actually zipped through quite quickly. And now we've walked to our gate and boarding is about to start any moment now. So it's six and a half hours to Japan and then after that we have a one hour transfer all the way back to our final destination of Los Angeles. We booked the aisle seat and the window seat. Uh, so hopefully there's no one sitting in between us, but we'll see what happens. Back. It is cold. It's, oh yeah. Shockingly cold. It's raining. The flight actually felt pretty short. The flight from Tokyo to LA was actually really, really empty. So I actually had the whole road to myself because I slept so well and so comfortably on the plane, I think I can stay awake the whole day and I think I'll be able to overcome jet lag pretty quickly. So immediately after exiting, LA County Department of Public Health actually has stations set up where you can do rapid COVID testing and they give you an additional test kit for you to do at home three to five days after arriving. So that definitely gives some peace of mind after traveling. 
So since our last video traveling back home from Thailand, we actually spent a few weeks attending a few weddings, hanging out with family and friends, and getting some work done. And now we're headed on a longer term adventure. We have a one-way ticket here to Turkey, and so we'll be here and in the surrounding countries for an extended period of time. That was too close. <laughs> too close. <laughs> Going to the Centurion Lounge because I need my coffee and I'm so hungry. So we just need to make a stop and then basically we're gonna book it to the gate. It's hard to slow things down and just eat. <laughs> I scarfed down two plates of food in five minutes. I think that's a record. And I also got coffee to go and Jeremy got a cookie to go. So I think we are doing pretty well. <laughs> so there were these two agents that wanted to interview us. Something about my new passport and asked if we were traveling as a family. I don't know if I was in trouble or something, but they split us up, interviewed us, asked us some pretty specific questions. And after that, it was fine. They let us go. I think in the end, I think what they were just doing is just checking that my old passport wasn't stolen and that the passport holder is in fact me. Once again, we're dashing to our gate. Boarding starting in like two minutes. control was super slow but checking back in and going through security on the domestic side super fast there were a ton of people working so we have some time until we have to board so we're going to go to the lounge This is actually our first time getting a one-way ticket away from home, so the future is somewhat open-ended right now. It's so funny because I always say that traveling with Jeremy, we're always rushing, always in a hurry. Well, today was no exception, so I'm definitely looking forward to a good night of sleep. So frankly, we're at this unique season in our lives where we're married, but there's just two of us so far. And so we're taking advantage of this transition season to explore the world, learn more about different languages, cultures, people, places. And so this feels like an exciting new chapter. We're gonna try some different styles. We're gonna be around different places. And so we're really eager to learn more about this part of the world. We're hoping to do more spontaneous things and fly off the seat of our pants a little bit more during this season. So we hope you've enjoyed this somewhat unusual video, this little life update from our travel day all the way to Turkey, but we hope you'll stay tuned. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to follow along as we explore Turkey, Greece, Georgia, Cyprus, and other countries around this area. And with that, we're gonna conclude this video and we'll see you next time. In our next video, we begin to explore the stunning country of Georgia. Don't miss it!